Good morning. It is another, as we would say, this is what we needed to take a toast to. A gummy day in Columbia, Florida. But we pray. So I thought I'd wake up, only some Folger coffee for the day to start my day off and eat me a bagel. Because I'm really not all that hungry. So I just thought I'd do a bagel this morning. Something simple. Something light and something right. Because I need to take this nerve medication to keep my nerves really, really calm right about now. Because you know what? Every day of your life, you wrestle against flesh and blood. Uh, principalities, they say, in dark places. A demon can be anybody. And a hello and a goodbye. My grandma used to say, it's due to anybody. I hope I'm not stepping on no toes today. Because I try not to. But it's okay. Because at the end of the day, I thought about greater than he, than in it's me. And it's bagel I got to eat. And I really don't want this bagel. Hmm? So I take it and I lay it on me a little pan. And I put it in the oven and let it do what it do. And then I put the rest of it back in the refrigerator so it stays fresh. And I, uh, uh, I count my many blessings. Uh, excuse me. I got a little air on my stomach. But I have to, some things come, they say without, you got a prayer and fast. Prayer and fast. Prayer and fast. And I said, hey, I will always know that evil lurks where evil is. That's what we say. Evil doers. And boy, I tell you, if I had nothing but time to try to make it seem like it's one side in a conversation. I'm glad you finally admitted that you cussed somebody out. But why was it that you only apologized to your mom? Huh? Why was it that you was the only one she knew about? Better yet, I see you trying to figure out whatever happened about this stolen chick I heard about. Huh? But like it said, monkey see, monkey do. I pray that whenever I get a husband, a provider again, that hey, I like him and he's gonna be jealous because I don't like jealous people. Let me blow my nose. Uh -huh. I don't I don't I don't even like people that wake up and as Madea say, La Ola. Some folk just they lives became a real to them. How dare anybody act like they can talk about a preacher when they have been lukewarm all over the internet? Better yet. Hey, I remember, you done talked about me so bad. I remember the only orig original regulators that I once knew as Van told me. You know who the regulators are. You've been riding for a long time. The regulators were, the boss is the truth. It was Riverbend. It was Riri. It was Van. It was Coco Love. And it was Riverbend. Okay, that was the original regulators I knew about. All the other stuff, I don't know about it. I really don't care today. After what I've been through, I really don't care. When people take the time to say, I cry victim, I have a right to voice my opinion just like an asshole. We all got one. When people try to make you say, you're the bad person, God never God never made, made one righteous person here on this earth. The Bible it's just basic instructions before leaving here. The Bible has been written so many times over and over and over. It's just, it's really not a actual copy of the Bible right now. Because you know why? It's been rewritten so many times to fit, to fit other people's situations. One thing I learned... When you tell one lie, you have to tell two lies. And all during the day, 
when I sit over yesterday, I watched these folks, like I told my, my family member, these folks running around here with guns, like they little soldiers walking up and down the street yesterday, AKAs in the broad open daylight, and extra cameras. Like I said, I don't care what gets shot up. My house been shot up three times since I've been on here. My car shot up. I still haven't fixed it. Been walking since September, and I have not cried. I said, and I just get tired of the extra on the YouTube. Huh? Because YouTube streets is not meant for everybody. People get friends all the time. Some friends are affiliation by associate of a conversation that was opinionated. Like, people out here in this YouTube street, as YouTube street has became a very bad sector where it's always a lot going on. People are beefing upon the situation, and it really shouldn't be a beef. Some people like to victimize people and act like you were more than what you were. Hell, I, at the end of the day, I, what, what people have have no bearing or no meaning on me. What people say about me, I really don't care. Because you know what? At the end of the day, hell, we all, I'm, I'm, just, I'm so fucking full right now. I just thought I'd sit here this morning and drink me some coffee as I wait on this bagel to get finished. I'm so freaking full right now that I thought about, how dare you talk about your daddy? I love you, Bishop W.C., Alexander, you know why? Because it take a man to raise some daughters. It take it took a man. Did he do a bad job? I think I turned out pretty good regardless of what you want to say. You don't respect my dad, and I don't respect you, Miss Civil Rights Activist. You are not a civil rights activist. What you are is a badass headache that didn't go away. I'll keep saying it. You is what I pray, God, just make a stop, make a shut up. Make her go away. I ask you to forget Michelle Alexander. Every time I fucking turn around, you're calling my fucking holy ass Lucifer ass name. Did I cuss? I got, I did. I cuss. What you gonna do? Say, oh, she's a Christian. What the fuck was you? Huh? How the fuck y'all be perfect, perfect motherfuckers who still judging Michelle Alexander? You know who the fuck he is. I just ain't called your holy name. Why? Because I'm not that kind of person. For real, for real. I try to I try to do stuff different now. And you know what made me try to do stuff different? When I saw I had an eager ass sibling running around here. Family can be anybody at the end of the day. Blood don't always make you family and blood don't make you right. Now, if I hadn't saw your ass in over 20, my daughter was 20, what was she young, five when, she, when your ass left here. I would have never told a lady, I didn't give a fuck, where her and her children stay at, where they live at, just get the fuck out of my house, and that's what I did. I got the fuck out of your house, took them keys to the judge, the other office, the courthouse, to that judge, and I left them damn keys there. I sold all my furniture, and I was headed to California. Sad I never got there. Sad you found me in Mississippi. Sad I was being beat the hell out of. Sad you just, uh, you just somebody that like to just victimize her. Huh? When I think about what I've been through in life, the abuse I endured as a child, I didn't put my business out there and he wasn't my business going your business because she ain't hit you in your head when you're too bad or where you got them broke bruises at. Huh? She ain't hit you in your head with a goddamn Coca-Cola ball, dead a hundred and ten stitches, and dead a goddamn war room right there. And the goddamn two by four mark is right here. I have headaches all the time. Why? Because of the pain I have endured. Huh? Do I like being your sister? Not today. I ain't like being your sister since I found out how even your ass ain't out there on the internet. Huh? This 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 the crazy lady talking for everybody today who what got mental health problems with me. Who got mental health habits and jokes with me. Now, I read the spirit. The spirit says it's some deception, it's some deceit, it's some mockery. I just brought this a little closer. Or do you want some vanilla? The sweetness, the extracts flavor for you. 
Just don't eat the sweet potato pie, baby. Okay, maybe you like to eat this year. Just don't eat the sweet potato pie. Ain't hey, they said? Sometimes I take up. So I say, let me drink some coffee. Give me my coffee going. Get Go get my water. Because I got to take this pill in a few minutes. I woke up in time. Just to start my morning with you guys. Just to encourage you. Thank you for my visitors. Thank you for the regulators support me. Thank you for the friends and family that come along the channel. Thank you for the enemies that come by and give me thumbs down. But God is good. Thank you. God is so good. Because you know why? Through this pandemic, I made it. You never be happy about stuff that goes on in life. You never be happy about who you really get as a blood sibling to you. Hey, she ain't been close to our family in years because of what you, the humility that you took your parent to. If you was getting a whooping, why was you getting a whooping? You thought you didn't deserve it? So now you're ungodly. Evil troll looking ass want to talk about my dad. Let's talk about you, little midget. Huh? Is, is your wig too tight or them, them curls on top of your head and you couldn't think, motherfucker? Huh? I asked you a question. Don't get jiggy with it either. Huh? Your public apology in October was supposed to be to YouTube viewers how you mocked and slandered and lied on Steve Harvey. That part. That was your public apology, and I got that from, I'm going to just say North Lucky Road, bitch. That part. I gave apology. If y'all didn't accept it, oh, well, it is what it is. Ain't no, y'all never got to speak to me. I ain't going to use no sleep. I love who I love, and I know who love Lady Blue. Thank you, Margie. I give you a special shout-out today, Margie. Thank you for always saying I love. we love you, Lady Blue. I give you, Days and Beloved, a special shout-out. Thank you for saying y'all love me, and I know y'all do. French, I, I endured, I, I enjoyed the talk last night. I always look, we, we, we keep our eyes open. I learned a lot by not having nobody to talk to. As Essie just brutalized me, victimized me, defamed my character, and now you came for fucking bishop. Now I come for your ass. No, nah, you ain't sin for me, bitch. I came home. At 12 years old, I could have sworn I was 11. You was 9. I went to that school, and your port car was tore up all along the ground. You had fucking D's and E's and F's. That showed you you weren't going to school. Or what was you doing? I found it. Then, I got a note to take back to that school. And when you got home from school, you didn't want your ass whooped. So what you decided to become the runaway slave. You say you was 12. Okay. We're going to leave it that you was 12. I'm going to believe you was 12 that day. Because why I say what you do to other people, you better believe your shit do come back to you. When you think your shit don't stink, your shit stink, honey. Don't nobody work really want to... Don't nobody want your ass but the man who's living with you. I'm trying to figure out what the hell he's still holding on for. What you holding on for, amazing grace? How sweet it sound? I got to get me another pouch, too. Because this one is getting real raggedy around right here. Huh? What What was the motive of whatever it was? I'm I'm, way, I'm far from being... Uh, I don't even know the words you said about me. I'm not desperate. I'm not lonely. I don't like your wife, your roommate, your fuck buddy, your cut buddy, your best friend. I don't like her. I don't like her. I don't like her ass. When I say I've been living my best life, I've had a wonderful time without your ass in Columbia, Georgia. I ain't going to even lie. All my life, you know how... You could try to be friends with somebody, and they can't friend you back. 
you try to be be nice to somebody and they can't be be nice to you back you try to love them and they don't can't love you right Essie, you never love me I just had to say that now. You could have never loved me. Oh, I'll never lock you up. Oh, you can trust me. I don't care what I say. That that it was you the friend, as Lil John say in the end, trying to fuck me in my ass? Or was you the motherfucker in the front, got all my business and tried to make me look like a damn fool on social media? I'll wait. Or I'm trying to figure out what was so special about you. That people weren't supposed to talk about you, but you don't talk about everybody, their mama, their sister, their daddy, they could. And Goat Lucy got you fucked up. You better stop fucking with Goat Lucy in the morning at 3 o'clock. And stop in them goddamn bun buns. Y'all ass driven goddamn big. I'm going to fall out. Between the both of y'all. Yeah, y'all was good with four fields. I'ma put that between the both of y'all. They say, do on to others as they would do on to you. I have to feed the little dog across the street. So whatever I scrap together for him, I don't know where he pap at again. He got to eat too. I say one thing about it. Uh, it's like gates. When I pull up on this mother sucker, it's gonna be facts. I said. I'm not a vegetarian, but I eat like a vegetarian. I don't know a lot about rest in heaven to you, King Nip, but from what I understood, he was a vegetarian. Maybe I probably would cook food saying this is what he liked because he was a vegetarian. He couldn't eat, he didn't eat meat. I have a family member like that that didn't eat meat for a long time. He just started eating meat. Because these meats have a lot of things that are actually hurting people. When I go to the store, I eat a lot of fish, chicken, and turkey now. Turkey is healthy for me. Turkey meat don't got as much fat. That's why I like I like turkey meat. God, now we almost got food stamps coming again. Thank you for the food. I've been had food in my refrigerator ever since a special lady from out of town sent went grocery shopping online for me. And I've been kicked. God been blessing me to keep food ever since. My cup is still burning over. Feel good to be hated. I just thought I'd give you a little bit of my energy this morning. Huh? I I I waited for an uh, infinity. Y'all know why y'all didn't get that public apology? Because I was still fucking with truth, fucking with spook, fucking with Riverbend on the internet. And who else? Because them the only ones got a channel. You can't stand my ass. I want to make sure you hate me today. My dad had, one day I talked to him, he said, I don't care if you got me on three-way, he don't like your ass. You call and you cuss your daddy out. Your daddy didn't cuss you out. I got the word. That's why he turned off his church phone in the church. You just start blowing up his phone at church like you done lost your mind. You a crazy ass little motherfucker. You can't make nobody fuck with a disrespectful, ungodly, side old child, ass little child. You were ungovernable then, and you're ungovernable, ungovernable, ungovernable. Whatever that fucking word is, I ain't gonna even say shit like you say. You just make me fucking sick. When I thought about. My dad say, at least you know you messed up your scholarship coming here for Essie. I was going to get you a condo and take you to the car lot to pick, let you buy whatever you want to buy, and I was going to pay for it. Because I was a straight A fucking student. So I start falling behind an ignorant ass, can't read, can't spell right, can't get a lies connected right, and you dare want to come up against me. You dare wanted people to think I was weak. You dare want to insult my mental capabilities. That's why Major Payne say, don't underestimate me, baby. Don't underestimate me. Gotta swallow these pills. I had to look at these suckers right quick. I hate swallowing pills. Uh, um, I, I hate taking these suckers. Uh. 
I've been taking them since I was 17 years old, off and on here when I came to Columbus, Georgia. Are you proud about your choices in life? <sighs> Only thing I wish God had gave me better siblings. I do. I wish they had gave me a better siblings, sisters and brothers. What she always said, me and my chill was close. Now nah, we ain't close. Because I got an iPhone, baby. Upgrades. I, like I say, upgrade. Get your beach hard. Get your beat hard coming for me. Will you be on that motherfucker like I do? This bitch cut off on a whole real fast. Cause y'all y'all would rather say ugly shit than you would positive shit about me. At the end of the day, a hater motivates me. When you can't do nothing else. They looking for me on YouTube and Facebook, y'all. I ain't on Facebook yet. I'm finna hop my ass off your phone and get on Facebook. Because I, I, I like to support my haters. My haters, yeah, Steve Harvey, my haters made me get on my motherfucking job. And the biggest hater I had has been my motherfucking family. At the end of the day, y'all can't make me or you can't break me. At the end of the day, I know how to survive all alone in Columbus, Georgia. At the end of the day, I have counted some beautiful people I really, really love, but... Hey, don't be selfish. I like to talk to everybody who talk to me back. They say pussy clap back. The pussy clap back. Boo. Snap, snap. That's why I got that comeback action on your ass. I don't be about it. I got that comeback action for real. Is it a man out here that I done had I can't never get again? God ain't made one that I can't be with again. Because God is good. Thank you for that public apology. Blueberry that you did not give me. You were supposed to have gave me to everybody you called bitches, hoes, motherfuckers, sluts, and so, so did dog and cat. That was too much of your pride. Pride bring up a big fall in a motherfucker life. So the motherfuckers that can't respect me, and and they say when what they say tell you to throw up some gang sign. Make sure you know how to throw that shit up right. ECG bitch, and I'm still stacking on your punk ass. I don't like your puss ass today, pow. Now, step by the station. Thank you for my subscribers. Thank you for the ones who motivated me. And thank you for the ones who didn't let me have a mental breakdown again behind this regular ass person. That part. Excuse my cussing. Who don't like it? Oh, well, you cuss too, unknowingly.